Hi, it's Matt with PanicExitPro.com, the leading authority on DIY installations of panic exit bars and door entry systems. Today we're going to talk about the Estate Swing 433 MHz wireless keypad access control. This would be very convenient for you in that you don't have to run wires through the wall of your building. The powerful 433 MHz signal can be sent through your building's walls to be received by this receiver. This receiver you have to purchase separately. Now here's what's interesting about this is besides being a device that you punch a code in and gain access to the building by unlocking one of the locks or electric strikes, this has four channels built into it. So one code for each channel. What you could do is have a code that activates one leg of this relay in here to activ activate the door any time of the day. So it, I would call that a manager code. You could type in a manager code, it activates relay one, and relay one is directly wired to the locking device, and that would activate the lock any time of the day. Then you can use the second channel in here and put in an access code that activates relay two. Relay two could be hooked up to a timer, and then the timer could can restrict access to only the business hours. That way you can have employees use the second code and the managers use the primary code. If you are doing this setup where you have the keypad and the receiver, one thing a lot of people like to have are remotes. These are small pocket sized remotes with visor clips on them. This also has the four channels on it. This can be used for multiple doors. So if you have this receiver set up on multiple doors throughout your property or multiple properties, you can retain buttons for these. And then if you're walking up to the door, you can just press the button on the remote to open the door for you as you walk up. Or if you're sitting at your desk and someone knocks on the door and you see through your video surveillance system it's someone you want to let in, you can press the button from your desk. This would have a range of about 300 to 500 feet in your office building to open your door for the person coming in. This access control device does not have a timed relay built into it. The relay is a momentary relay, which means it should either be paired with a lock that has a timed release built into it. This would be indicated by a nucleus icon on our website or paired up with one of these timers. This timer is a very simplistic timer. It has a one to four second release time and is typically only used for one lock on one door with up to two access control devices. This relay is a more robust system it can have many access control devices hooked up to it and multiple locks hooked up to it. And it can release for a longer period of time, anywhere in the seconds range all the way up to 15 minutes. These are also listed on the website. You'll see the nucleus icon. The main thing to keep in mind with door access control systems when you're purchasing through PanicExitPro.com is you will need a device that has the nucleus icon in the cart somewhere with your kit. Either a lock will have to have it on there, the entry system product has to have it on there, or you have to have one of these timed relays that will have that nucleus icon on it. But that will be the controls of the system for how long the door will release for. At Panic Exit Pro, you probably noticed that we have just about everything you need to enter or exit your building. From our panic bars, to our keypads, to our proximity car readers, our emergency access control, our wireless, touchless devices, and even our simple push buttons. But what you might not have noticed is our expert support. Seven days a week we have people standing by that can help you wire anything together, install anything on your doors, or troubleshoot applications that you might not know what to buy and how to buy it for your application. We're here to help. Give us a call and we'll be happy to do so.